One day, a desert in the middle of nowhere was feeling uncertain. The desert was devastated that the moon was fading once again. Each time the moon faded, she felt that the moon would leave forever. This frustration would cause her to stir up the wind, to spiral up a hobbob of sand. Will the moon come back, the desert thought? Because of her anxiety, the hobbob of sand intensified. Soon she was so consumed by her worry that she did not notice that her once beautiful horizon was completely gone. Now, there was no place for the moon to return to. Even the sky was covered in her dust. She began to cry. A cloud not far off in the forest seen that something was wrong. He managed to quickly move through the thick dust. It was even thicker than a nimbosturous cloud, which was full of rain and thunder. On and on he went. Rocks, sand, and even a kangaroo moose kicked him in the face. Oh, it felt endless, but he conquered it. Whoosh, I survived. The cloud murmured. He tapped the desert on the shoulder. I seen from far off a display pure of disorder. Stunned by the cloud's voice, chaos ceased. Desert, now calmer, peered into the wide, compassionate eyes of the cloud. It's not every day that a cloud graces my presence. Legend has it that you are wise, a true witness of day turning into night. Surely you can tell me if the moon will return whole, or will it vanish forever? The cloud pondered for a moment and answered, Dear Desert, the moon needs time to become full. It is a process. Everything in life is a process. There are four moons each month. Full, third quarter, new, and first quarter. And on top of that, there are 12 months in a year. Each cycle has to come in its own time. But I still don't understand why does it fade. Is it painful for the moon? I really don't like the cycle that you speak of. Each time the moon leaves, the hole in my heart grows bigger and bigger. I fear it may never return. The cloud chuckled. The moon does not feel pain. The sun lights different parts of the moon as the moon revolves around the earth. We only see the parts that are lit up. Rest assured, the moon is always fooling with you, even when you do not see it. It is there.